section here uh, until Polly was uh, built. Uh, but their lab, you know, they played all over the place. I hear all the stories of people following the balls, just like little number of our fans. Uh, and so, yeah, this is exactly, and what's really cool is that chalkboard, if you go look at it over there, it's a chalkboard that Coach used to line the team up there and, and write on. It's the actual board itself. Pretty cool. Coach, will you be able to practice in the sports arena at all? You know, we're going to practice. We're going to have a, a scrimmage October 27th. Uh, over there, a closed scrimmage against Cal State Fullerton. And we'll practice over there uh, one other day other than that, so just a couple times. Logistically, it's so hard uh, because of traffic and uh, you know, classes. We're in, we're in school here. How's the How do you see the fans? You've got some older hardcore fans. Do you think that that's You know what? I mean, I know uh, there's a lot of excitement right now as people are signing up for their new seats, or picking them out, I should say. And uh, I'm going to really make a concerted effort to get out to the students, the fraternities, the sororities, and really reach out to our fans. It really, to me, is so important. We have a chance to, I think, really be a good team this year. And we need our fans. We need the support to be there for them. These kids deserve that. They have worked really, really hard in the offseason. So I really will uh, be employing our fans to come out and support the Bruins. I know it's harder to get to downtown than it is to get to here from a lot of places. Uh, and, you know, we originally were going to, we are talking about having it at the Forum, and then uh, I went to a concert there, and it took forever to get there, so it's easier to get to Sports Arena than it is to the Forum. That's one of the consolations. Prince? Prince, yeah, and it took us literally an hour, my wife and I, to get from the 405 to the Forum that day. I was like, yeah. where'd you go? I mean, you got to stay off Manchester. Yeah, I think, I think that's the way we went. Uh, you know, you, you said you, have, you think this team has a chance to be really good this year. That's, that's saying a lot when you lose two starters. Oh, two two very good idea. starters. Two yeah. two uh, very good players. Both all league players. Uh, but yeah, you know, so. we even though Travis and Dave Ware did not play last year, they were with us the entire year. So they're not coming in brand new. They're going to fit right in. And we're, we're going to have to, you know, we're going to at times play big this year. There will definitely be times where we're going to play. Uh, we have three real big players on the front line, and we'll, we'll give up some things maybe defensively. I hope not too much, but we should gain. We should be a very good rebounding team at both ends of the floor. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm very excited about you know, this group. And, uh, I think these guys really like each other. Uh, you know, I think we have uh, you know a senior point guard in Lazaric who's going to be a lot better than he was. I think Jeremy's going to give us another good year like he did last year. Those guys are the key. Is Josh Smith, how has he looked in workouts and what's his, how's his weight? You know, he's really improved his uh, offensive scoring back. Like when he first got here a year ago, he had one basic move. Now he's got, you know, he's got jump hooks to both shoulders with both hands. He's, he's got a lot more stuff to his game that he worked on in the spring and again here in the fall for the last few weeks. And I think he's going to be much improved. You know, Josh has still got a ways to go condition-wise to be where he needs to be uh, for us. Uh, and uh, you know, that's something that uh, we're going to work on very hard here as we start the month. You said that, well, I think of 12 or 13% body fat in the for You know what? It has been measured lately. And no, I wouldn't share that with you. That's a uh, personal one. That's not you. Now I can tell you my body. Yeah, what's yours, Doug? It's it's ugly, whatever it is. It's ugly. But it would, it would be inappropriate for me to uh, uh, share one of our players' body fat unless, uh, you know, and I don't even know what some more. I know that in the past we've had guys that have been really, you know, sometimes too low. Uh, that was one of the things that uh, our strength coaches talked about with the wares and Reeves. Even. They're so lean that when you start running, you know, up and down all the time, they're going to uh, have to really be concerned about not losing any muscle mass because there's no fat to burn. Malcolm.